clavicle malunion. It is difficult to reduce and maintain the reduction of clavicle fractures. And it doesn't matter if you use a sling or you use figure eight strap, the clavicle will heal. It will heal despite the displacement and in the mid clavicle area, in the shaft of the clavicle, there will be deforming forces, which will include the weight of the arm will pull the distal fragment inferiorly and medially, and the sternocleidomastoid will pull the proximal fragment superiorly. So despite the bump that the patient feels and some displacement, and despite the deformity, usually healing occurs rapidly. The healing occurs in about 85% of the cases, and the clavicle will not be aligned because it's hard to reduce it, and keep it reduced will be hard to achieve that without surgery. So you end by some degree of malunion and maybe shortening. The fragments are not lined up and the distal fragment will look like it's down and anteriorly rotated. Shortening is clinically significant because it alters the dynamic of the muscles around the shoulder. It also narrows the costoclavicular space. The patient may complain of decreased shoulder strength and endurance if the patient had a displaced mid-shaft clavicle fracture that healed with more than 2 cm of shortening. So what are the symptoms of malunion? The patient may have pain, easy fatigability, cosmetic problems, especially in female. The patient may have neurological dysfunction, involvement of brachial plexus, especially on the nerve. The patient may have thoracic outlet syndrome. So you're going to decide to do surgery. So you need to know the amount of shortening by comparing both clavicle in the same firm. Check for how much overlap between the ends of the clavicle. Surgery may be successful in restoring the function and relieving the pain. How do you do the surgery? You will do clavicle osteotomy in the plane of the healed fracture. So the fracture is recreated and the deformity is corrected and the length is restored. We're going to use local or iliac crest bone graft if we need it. And if you do an osteotomy and reduction of the clavicle to its pre-injury position and you find out that will leave you a significant bone defect at the osteotomy site, then you will need tricortical piece of bone at the osteotomy area. It's probably better to use a pre-contoured clavicle plate in the superior position with six cortices in each side of the osteotomy. Thank you very much for listening. This video is for educational purposes only. Please consult your doctor before you make any decision about your medical care.